Hey guys, this is Frank from Happy Coder. Today in this video, I would like to talk to you guys about how to use two pieces of Chrome browser extensions that allow you to interact with your Chrome browser with keyboards only, as long as you know the Vim key bindings without having to rely on your mouse. So just a very quick demo. If we, if we open a new tab and go to google.google.com, Google and um, let's say I want to search for the new Nintendo Switch, N Nintendo Switch 2. Instead of having to use my mouse to click into the search area, I can just, if you look at my uh, keystrokes here, I just need to enter capital letter I and it opens up a text area that has built-in Vim key bindings. So from here, uh, the cursor is currently the, the block one, so I can click I to enter the insert mode and I can type in uh, Nintendo Switch 2 and press enter and you can see because the floating text area is just another instance of the search bar whatever text we have inputted in the floating text area has been registered or recorded in the search bar so now we can simply press enter to use the Vimium extension to better navigate around the page we can press F and you can see all the links all the navigation related elements are all labeled with little letters so for example if we want to open up this article that is labeled SL we just need to press the letter combination in succession so we do SL and that opens up the the, the link in the new tab so yeah, that's pretty much all I want to show you guys. So the, the first piece of uh, Chrome extension is called Vimium. You guys can go watch the video recorded by the official developer. And this extension essentially enables you to navigate around your page in a more efficient way using the Vim key bindings. And the second piece of Chrome browser extension is the one that I just showed you guys with the floating text area. It's called Surfing Keys. So anytime, if as long as your page has a prominent text input area, so anytime if you're, let's say that you're interacting with LLMs, you can do the same thing. You press capital letter I and you can do, for example, what are, give me a list of the best uh, JRPGs on Nintendo Switch. And because I already know the Vim key bindings and it's my preferred way of interacting text at all times, I found the combination of these two Chrome extensions, it just allows me to interact with my browser in a more efficient way that you can achieve when you're relying on moving your mouse with your hand. So that's it guys, it's a very short video today. I hope you found it to be informative and I'll see all of you in the next video. Bye bye.